How's it going, folks? Chris the Pirate Knight here, and welcome to my channel. I am here with my friend Kev, Night. the Orc. Friend? You know, acquaintance, associate, former co-host. Still former. current co-host sometimes. I was going to say, fuck you. <laughs> Long-suffering bitch who's put up with you. I mean, my horns are falling out. It's that bad. hey oh, And we are here today to do a tech demo here on the Pyron Knight in regards to uh, Xbox and, and, and being able to connect to a remote Xbox and, and play local co-op games together. So uh, I was uh, reading an article on Facebook of all places uh, about console streaming your, your Xbox to your PC, which I've been doing for years. Uh, the Xbox One was able to do it through the Xbox Companion app, and now you can do it through the Xbox app, even with the Series X and S. And uh, get rid of that Xbox Companion app, because it, it's no longer necessary. So, what you need to do, though, first, is we're going to start from scratch. I, I came up with this idea that we tested a while ago, and it works. Um, and so I wanted to demo it for you of, well, if you can stream your console to your PC, and if someone else can connect to your PC via the Parsec app, which I'll, I'll, sh I'll show you in, in a second, then why can't that person also connect to your Xbox and play Xbox with you? Like and like, share, and subscribe. And so uh, we're going to go ahead and show you the tech demo on how to do this. But first, make sure that you do smash that like button up there. It's down there, but see, it's showing it there. And share this video and hit subscribe as well if you haven't. And also ring that bell so you get notifications when I drop videos like this and other videos like uh, my trailer reactions or uh, we play Pulsar the Con Lost Colony oh, over on that side. And, uh, yeah. So do it. Do it. Do it now. Go look at those videos. They're so much fun. So much fun. And so is this video. So stick around first. Because what we have to do to be able to make sure that Kev, who's 4,000 miles away from me. No, we near far enough. Can play Xbox with me. As if he's in the room with me. And mm -hmm. control my Xbox. So the first thing we need to do is bring up my computer, which we'll do. Look at that. There it is. And then the first thing you want to do is open up your browser. Kev, if you could slide down for a second, please. I've heard that before. Ooh. I, 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 mm. No, anyway. I don't need any more face paint. <laughs> and go to parsec.app slash login. That link is down below. You could just go to parsec.app right now and Download the app first and then create an account. But when you create an account, it's going to ask you to, you know, verify your email anyway and download the app. So you might as well just do that first. So then what you want to do, Kev, you can slide back up now. Oh, is you'll run that. So unsatisfying. You'll run that Parsec app. And uh, it'll look a little like this. Now, as you can see, I've connected to some other people's computers before. So their computers show up. And then my computer's right here as well. And Kev, you've connected to my computer before, correct? Yes. So you can go ahead and just con click connect. So go ahead and do that for me. I but, have clicked connect. Yeah, at, and besides doing that, I could also click share and share a link. But. I'm going to go ahead and accept, Kev. You can also reject the person if you have someone just trying to connect and you don't want them to connect. You, uh, and you can create a list, actually, of people who don't have to be accepted. I would never create that list just on the safe side of things. And one thing you can also do, Kev, can you slide back over? Gosh darn it. God damn it. You, yeah, Jesus, I move out the way and then I move back and yeah, now I'm back gosh. and move again. Jeez. And so I can give him keyboard and mouse control, but I'm only going to give him gate pad control today because I want to be able to only have him access my Xbox. So go ahead and slide back now. Now you can oh, also go into the so settings. Generous. 
You can also go back into this in the Fuck settings, those host settings, change which monitor the person sees, what's audio source they hear, and I've got it all set to the things like bandwidth, things like that. So I've got that all set. So you can go ahead and minimize that. Uh, I can minimize that. And then what you'll want to do is the Xbox app, which uh, comes with Windows. You might have to download it in the Microsoft Store. Not hard to do. Uh, but this is what it looks like when you, you pop it up. And you'll want to set up your Xbox Connect. My, uh, you can go that. It'll, it'll say uh, there'll be a console list. You'll be able to bring up. Oh, why did it do that? Uh, you pressed the wrong button. You, no, it's the, the overlay thing. You know, I clicked over by the overlay. So click my console list, which it doesn't seem to want to do. So regardless, screw that. We will just connect right to the Xbox because I only have one console. That's probably why it is. So here we go. As it comes up, hey, look, there's my Xbox remotely connected. Now, let me show you something first before you do anything. Uh, this is my PC Xbox controller, as you can see. Not plugged in. So, the only controller I am using is my wireless controller, which is connected to my Xbox. So, Kev. I'm going to hold this like this. Go ahead. Remember, you got to mm -hmm. click on the screen. You hit Y, didn't you? I did. <laughs> now move it. Yeah, see? See? Now he's moving it. So there you go. So now, look, he's starting up Mortal Kombat. Oh, you want to play some Mortal Kombat, huh? Bring it. <laughs> Bitch, I'm going to hit you so fucking hard. Your grandchildren are going to be fucking bruised. Screw you. I kick your butt. Now show people you can skip all this stuff if you're able to. I don't remember if you can. I can't remember if I can. No. Oh, oh, but he babe. was able to start it. Sign me in, please. I'm signing in, Chris. <sighs> so now we'll go to a fight. Local. Oh, I'll sign in with my other profile. Okay. Oh, is it going to ask me for the password? Because I haven't yeah, signed it in might for do. a while. Yeah, yeah. I'll do that. Uh, okay, nope, we're signing in with Amber's then. <laughs> She's not using <laughs> it right now. There we go. <laughs> All right, so click, click local, Kev. All right, and then I can hit A. Oh, you hit A to join. It's on me for some reason. There you go. Whoa! You, just, you click. It's your controller. Remember, you said your controller was possible. Yeah, my bad. controller is. <laughs> and I've got my the control old tradition, so we got cool characters like Rambo, Terminator, Robocop. They're not very good, in my opinion, but, you know, and not classic. Skin. I mean, I'm gonna just gonna go classic, you know? Yes, my control pad is on the way out. I'm gonna take Spawn, though. Ooh! Now, that one is a cool DLC character. So, I guess I could look over here. I don't know why I'm looking at this screen when I got it on the big TV, too. Uh, choose choose the variant. Ooh, Deadpool Scorpion. It's spawn. That's what I call him. Deadpool Spawn. <laughs> he looks kind of like Deadpool. You gonna uh, pick the random? Yeah, yeah, random. How does the input lag feel, Kev, on just the menus right now? It's good. Excellent. Excellent. Like I say, my control pad's on the way out, so I've got to be a little bit careful, but... Sure, sure, sure. And we're not going to necessarily play a full match here, folks. I just want to show you a demo of this. I like looking in a mirror. I like looking at one of the Round one. Fight. No, we've got this. Remember controls. Oh. All right. Go ahead and, and fight me. Do stuff. All right. Sorry. Tell no. me how the input right. lag is. Well, I'm just going to... Punch, punch, yeah. about three milliseconds. That's not bad at all, I would say. No, that's 4,000 miles away, guys. All I've got to do is remember the actual controls. Yeah. We don't play Mortal Kombat very much, folks. Oh, wait, I remember this one. Oh, wait, no. ah. ah, damn it. Nice. <laughs> Oh, I haven't played this since we were very drunk. Yes, uh, agreed. Did we do it for the charity? Too, actually. We did it for charity, folks. Yeah. Oh. oh, my 
Yeah! Oh my. Oh my! Oh no, I missed you with mine. We'll play at the end of this round, folks, and then I wanna... Oh, fucked oh. up there. Yeah, I fucked up on that one. Ah, I missed again. Yeah, I mean, I'm... Ah, it, I accidentally well. hit start, sorry. Oh, fucking distractions. <laughs> that was fucking cheap. I know, my bad. No, that's an accident. <laughs> All right. But no. <laughs> we played around. Kev, go ahead and hit the pause button. I'm not going to touch the controller anymore. Controller is being put down, folks. Go to the, head to the main menu and go to go to single player mode, and then you know, or go go here, go fight Gary. Go go to actually hit the home button. You know, hit the Xbox button. Yeah, that controller. doesn't work on this control pad. Oh, it's broken, huh? Yeah. Here. That one's not the best. Oh uh, no, no, it's because it's console. That's why. Because it's see if you. No, 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 no. Main menu. No, 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 no. Stop. Go down now. Oh. Uh, okay. I open that up. Now go to My Games and Apps. Ooh, blah, blah, blah. Up top. My there Games go. and Apps. Oh, you know why? Hold on, hold on, hold on. That's why. Let me go sign this profile out. See, you have to... There we go. Now... Now do it. Now go to My Games and Apps. Go to See All. My Games and Apps. Yep. And then choose a game. Nothing to do a single player game. Just... Yeah. Oh, I haven't played that in a while. No, 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 it's like uh, Tunic, for example. It's like a, uh, a Zelda tile game style game. Yes, I know. Yeah, I am not touching. That. My hands are free, folks. Look at this. He's four thousand miles away. What? what? If I do new game, would it delete it? Just click continue and continue mine. I haven't got a clue what the controls are, but we'll it's see. Just hack and slash. Just hit X. Pretty sure. Yeah. Uh, yeah, X does hit things. Okay. Oh, I have no idea where I am. Sorry. I don't know how to get out of here. But, as you can see, folks. Oh, that does something. And there's a blobby thing. How yep. do I get down? Oh, I see the bloody thing. Stairs right there. Yep. yep. Oh, it blows up apparently. I didn't remember that. All right. So as you can see, folks, he's playing a single player game. Look at that. All right. Now, Kev, go ahead and hit, hit A to get back to home. Oops. No, 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 no. Hit A. The hell? Yeah, I, he's not taking me back to home. There you there go. It goes. So now go over to Pluto TV. I'm only gonna do this for a second because it's the Stargate. Stargate. Hey, look, you can watch some Stargate. Hi. Oh, Claudia Black. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> mm. So, folks. And then when we're like, all right, we're done. You know, you can disconnect your Xbox. Close the Xbox app. Open Parsec back up. And, and kick Kev, me. Can you uh, slide down for a second? Please? I can. Or yeah, over the right, me. even. Hold Somewhere on, I've got to get the other screen up. Gotcha. You're good. And then I click that. And at the bottom here is kick. And now Kev is no longer attached to my computer. Thank God. That that porn fucking history of yours is just disgusting. <laughs> and then you just go ahead and close Parsec. So, folks, look at that. You can connect to, your, to, to someone else's Xbox remotely via the Parsec app and a PC. All you need is... Uh, and I'm going to disclaimer here. I have gigabit internet. I'll put all that in the, uh, in the description. I have gigabit hardwired... Uh, console and PC, so it makes it you know a good connection. You do have to have you know a somewhat good connection. You know, I'd say at least 100 megabits per second. Kevin, and also, you've got to remember 
not to set regions the wrong way. Remember when um, we were doing the charity stream, I was playing Sifu. I was parsecced into your computer, to your Xbox via your computer, which was connected to a UK server to bounce back to you, to bounce to me. So remember yes. that when it was doing the whole input thing was like 12, 18,000 miles yes. back to back. Yes. That and gives a little bit of lag. It does. Um, <laughs> it also, the, the better your computer, the better it'll be too. It, there's all these factors that have to do my computer. I'm on a budget setup here. Uh, and it may seem like a cool setup, but it's pretty budget compared to some of the setups out there. The internet is my probably strongest asset. Uh, and and my console, true. the Xbox series X, which this was done done on. So uh, it's really cool. I've done, you know, connected with Parsec for to play Lego games, like we said, to play Jackbox, just to be able to, for you to hear audio. You can use it as a business tool as well. Parsec is a, a fantastic uh, app. I, I highly recommend it. And, of course, I'm a, I'm a, I love the Xbox. And I I think you can do this with PlayStation 2 because um, there is a PlayStation remote app. But I don't think it's as stable uh, because, obviously, the uh, connectivity of Windows, Microsoft Windows and Microsoft, Microsoft Xbox, Xbox Series X. Exactly. So, folks, uh, thanks for, for checking out this tech demo. Kev, appreciate your help as always. Make sure that you folks do smash that like button, share this video, also hit subscribe if you haven't, and ring that bell so you know when I drop videos like this or other cool videos or when I go live. And f folks, I am the Pyron Knight. My name is Chris, and I'll catch you later. Bye. Adios.